in this adventure, my brother and I. This will be home for the night. We're all in bed now in the in my car. Beautiful views. Welcome to the enchantments. <laughs> we can finally see the road. We made it. Man, that was a doozy. Ended up being just over 20 miles. Welcome back to a new video. Welcome back to a new adventure. In this adventure, my brother and I, we're gonna be through hiking the enchantments. It's been on our list for years now. We're finally gonna knock it out. This is the weekend, it's gonna happen. But currently, right now, we're trying to figure out my platform because normally my platform for my bed's over here. So my bed's in there. But we gotta figure out a way of We gotta figure out a way of getting my brother in here as well. Because we will be car camping in this vehicle tonight, and then we'll be heading up on the trail in the dark like 4 a.m before the sun comes up we'll be starting up to kolchuk it's gonna be 21 miles total about 5500 feet of gain easy dude we literally just put this board on here and then stuck a backpack under here to support them and uh hopefully that works it's probably not gonna be the best night's sleep ever so without further ado buckle up get ready for this adventure it's gonna be a big one i'm so stoked to finally do this trail let's get over to leavenworth made it to the Snow Lakes Trailhead. It's about 9.45 p.m. So Caleb and I are gonna hop in the back here and probably just go straight to bed. Try to get as many hours of sleep as we can. We'll be getting up pretty early, probably about a 3.30 a.m. wake up call. And we'll take one of the cars up to the cold truck trailhead and we'll start the hike bright and early, so. This will be home for the night. That was so graceful, man. <laughs> oh, man, that was funny. Home sweet home. Oh, God. Yeah. Just like old times. Ah. Old twins. Ah. Dude, that's so hard <laughs> to get in from the from back there. Dude. Make sure it closes, dude. I think we just leave it open. Yeah. That'd be terrifying. All right, we're all in bed now in the in my car. It's actually not too bad. It's kind of roomy. We do fit in here pretty well, actually. But it's almost 10:30, so we're gonna get some rest, and we'll be waking up at 3:30 in the morning. Hopefully, we'll get up to Cold Chuck before sunrise. That's the goal. Yeah. And we'll see you guys in the morning. <laughs> Enchantment time. First things first, we got a fuel. All right, we made it to the coal truck trailhead. We're gonna make sure we got everything packed up and then we'll be getting on the trail. Let's do this, man. Right. Pretty much the first two hours of this hike are gonna be in the pitch black dark. <laughs> but it's gonna be great. Let's, be get, great. let's get done. We are officially off onto the Kolchuk Trail, about four miles up to Kolchuk. We'll pretty much be doing this whole hike in the dark. Let's get it done. Uh, 
my quick update. I've been hiking for about an hour now, almost two and a half miles in. So we got about a mile and a half left into the lake. It's currently 5.41 a.m. So we're doing good pace. Should be a cold shock by sunrise. Still dark as ever. Can't see anything, <laughs> but we're making headway. Sun is starting to come up, man. It's about 6.15, so the sun should be rising in about 20 minutes. We're about three and a half miles in, so we got about a half mile to the lake. Whew, feeling good. Stopped here for a little snack break real quick. Beautiful views. Man, it's gonna be a gorgeous day, man. How you feeling, man? Not bad. Heck yeah, dude. We're almost there to the cold chuck. Getting after it. That'll be a good milestone. Sweating hard. But once, once we're to Kolchak, we'll do uh, some food, kind of take a little rest, and then we'll be sending it up Asgard. But let's keep moving. We've made it to Kolchak. Look at that. That is incredible. Look how blue the water is. It's about 6.40 in the morning. So I don't know what time the sun hits this peak, but it's absolutely spectacular. And now, we have to work our way around the, the right hand side and then up Asgard Pass. That's where we're going. And that is going to be a doozy of a climb, but we're going to take a break here, get some rest, get some food and some water, and then we'll make our way up Asgard. Once we get over that, we are in the core enchantments, man. It's going to be amazing. The weather is perfect right now, too. Completely clear. Unreal. This is awesome. Look at this lake, man. The, the color is just insane, how blue it is. And then Dragon Tail Peak right here. Doesn't even seem real. Yes. That's breakfast. Are we not? Why did your shoe off? <laughs> Give him a little air, man. All right, we are refueled up, making our way around the lake to the backside where we'll be entering Asgard Pass. We've officially entered the boulders. Just this massive boulder field. Lake's over here. And there's Dragon Tail. Then that is Asgard. We gotta go up that. This is gonna be so fun. <laughs>
beautiful. We have officially entered into Asgard Pass. And you just start going up, man. Look at the lake, though. The sun hit the mountains over there. It's gorgeous. Gorgeous. All right, we're already going to take our jackets off. It's getting warm. Man, you're behind a lot. Take our jackets off, do a go gel. Keep moving. Kind of a free for all up these boulders, but you just look for these little Cairn towers and they help your way up. We've come a long ways already. There's Cold Jug way down there. We have climbed almost 3,400 feet now. And we're probably about halfway up the pass. We're feeling pretty good. We get to the top of this, six miles of like. With 6,000 feet of gain. We're just been following these guys, little Karen Towers, and make our way up. Five. The biggest goat I've ever seen. It's staring at me right now. Look at this thing. Wow, that thing was incredible. It was so majestic. That's the biggest goat I've ever seen. That thing was stout. Just pure muscle. This is his humble abode. We're just visitors. That goat wakes up to this every morning. So cool. We're still just trudging up this pass. And man oh man are we climbing. It's just straight up. But I like to think we're getting kind of close. Hopefully. The sun hitting this peak behind me is so beautiful. Look at that. It's incredible. We've come a long way since the lake now too. It's way down there. And it's starting to look like we might be getting close. Top of the ridge is right here, top of the pass. How you feeling, man? Not bad. Not Hell bad. Okay. We've been fueling up quite a bit, so we're feeling pretty good. Just gotta get to the top of this pass, man. Then we'll be in the enchantments. Cannot oh, wait. Man, Feels like we're hiking somewhere in the Alps.
never ends. Never effing ends. We made it. Welcome to the enchantments. <laughs> wow. That's incredible. Go over there with a view. Man. Man, this place is incredible. Now we just gotta find a nice little spot for some lunch. And just soak it all in, man. Oh, I'm so happy right now. It's fantastic. These peaks are incredible. I feel like I'm in the Swiss Alps. <laughs> oh man, this is awesome. Oh baby, look at this. Look at this. Oh yeah. You could go up there. That's gorgeous. I think we found lunch spot. This is Isolation Lake. Absolutely incredible. The enchantments, man, so cool. Look at this. Oh, wow. That is well worth the climb, man, I will say. Well worth it. All right, we just finished up with lunch on Isolation Lake, and now we're gonna keep on moving down the trail. Check out some other lakes up here in the Enchantments. There's about six or seven lakes up here, I believe. And they're all so beautiful. This one was Isolation, great spot for lunch. We're all filled up, fueled up, ready to go. Keep on moving through the Enchantments, man. This is incredible. Spectacular. Can't beat it. This is Tranquil Lake, I believe. It's a beauty. We're gonna make a quick pit stop to fill up our waters, replenish all the liquids, and we'll keep on trudging. But look at this view. Incredible, man. Incredible. <laughs> See you later, Isolation Lake. We're gonna keep it moving to some more lakes right over this hill. I can't get over this view though, man. It's amazing. came up from up there. So we just passed Ol Run and Sig Run Lake. Those are the lakes behind this right here. These cool little ponds on these huge boulder fields. Truly paradise for the goats up here, man. I wish I was a goat.
Look at this little guy just hanging out up here. Man, what a home that would be. Doing freaking laps, dude. Just living up here. In the enchantments. Dang, Dang got some goat crap. Is that goat? That means it's nearby, man. It's probably grizzly. Hopefully not. I wouldn't mind seeing some more goats, though. Hopefully. The goats? Yeah. Wow, look at that. Incredible. That's Crystal Lake down there. Unbelievable. Look at that. Spectacular, man. Keeps getting better. <laughs> View of that in toilet. The That's your toilet view in the enchantments. That's just ridiculous. <laughs> I feel like I'm just pointing and filming everywhere because everywhere is so beautiful. I'm just like overwhelmed by everywhere I look. Just I want to film everything. <laughs> oh man. So this is the beautiful Inspiration Lake. And I tell you, it's inspiring me to jump in, man. <laughs> but it's probably freezing. It feels like I'm on another planet right now. It doesn't even feel like this is real life. <laughs> it's crazy. I can't believe how pointy that peak is, man. Look at that toothpick. This is perfection, like. Looks pretty perfect to me. I just can't get over this place, man. <laughs> yeah. This place is truly incredible, man. It's just unreal. The creativity of our Lord and Savior creating this? Are you kidding me? No. What a beast. Look at this tree. God thought of this right here. He's like, yeah, oh, let me make this tree. It's flipping amazing. <laughs> That's awesome. How is this even real life right now? Look at this water. Crystal clear. Man. God is good, man. That's all I got to say. God is good. This is Sprite Lake. This place feels like it's something out of like a fairy tale book. It's just nuts. Every single corner you go around is just like this magnificent view that you can't even comprehend. It's, I feel like I'm walking through a Disney movie or like a fairy tale book. It's amazing. Look at this. What? Oh, man. 
enchantments something else then look at over here you look the other way and bam even more views <laughs> doesn't stop This is Leprechaun Lake. Yet another beauty. So we're almost 10 miles in now and I think I think we're gonna take a break here at Leprechaun Lake. Get some more food in us. Maybe take a dip into the lake as well. Kind of rejuvenate. And then from here we'll be sending it down pretty much. But man, this is a beautiful lake. Look at this. Look at the water pristine in the view it's insane and even over here incredible truly an incredible place all right let's take these bad boys off let the dogs air out How is it, man? <laughs> Freezing? It's horrible. That cold, eh? I guess the water's freezing. <laughs> It'd be good for the feet, though. Help with the swelling, maybe. Give this water a try. Oh! Yeah, it's freezing, dude. Oh! What time is it? Oh my goodness, that is not warm. You know? <laughs> Look at this guy. No better place to ice the legs than the enchantments. Nice little peanut butter and honey. I think I might try and take a little dip in this lake, man. Even though it's absolutely freezing, once I'm in and out, I think I'll feel really good. Because when else can you say you went swimming in the enchantments, right? <laughs> Gotta do it. All right, wish me luck. That was freezing, but man, it felt so good. So refreshing. After hiking 10 miles and we still have 10 miles left, that just brought me back to life. I think our break is over. We're getting everything packed up again, getting our shoes back on, and then we'll be starting our final push out of here. There's one more after this. It's uh, Vivian, I think. And then that's it for the enchantments. And then you start heading back down towards Snow Lakes, and then it's just a grind back to the parking lot. But today's been incredible man the enchantments is truly enchanted it, it lived up to all its hype i'll tell you that much spectacular place but yeah now it's time to get back on the trail This is the final lake of the enchantments, Lake Vivian. Wow, what a beauty.
There's snow lakes. We'll be walking out along those. We have hiked a total of just over 10 miles so far. We're gonna start making our way out of here. We'll be heading down snow lakes. That'll be our way out. So we have probably about eight or nine miles out of here still. It's gonna be a brute, a brute of an exit. We're both feeling it pretty well on our feet and we're only like halfway. So <laughs> it's been let's a go. spectacular day so far, but. Let's go baby. Let's finish this thing off. Beautiful weather. What? Beautiful weather. <laughs> Forecast was wrong per usual. Yeah, they were saying it'll be cloudy today. It was perfect weather for this man. Blessed. Thank you, Jesus. They have rebar in the rock for steps to keep your grip. We don't want to do this in the rain, that's for sure. Nice and easy. Nice and easy. Calculated steps. It's a pretty gnarly section there. It's like rock climbing. Refill the water bottles real quick. Keep moving. Let's get out of here. Two o'clock. Man, the water is just spectacular. Two Bye, enchantments. It was a pleasure. Oh my gosh. Huh. Huh. That was stupid. Huh. Bye, enchantments. It was a real pleasure, an absolute pleasure. All right, we've entered the full grinding stage of getting off this mountain. So I'm gonna have to bust my poles out. I have them attached to my pack. So I'm gonna have to put you guys away for a little bit. Maybe I'll check in periodically, we'll see. It's gonna take us about three hours to get down and potentially it's only gonna take you guys 20 seconds. <laughs> okay. We made it to Snow Lakes. We're about 12 miles in now, grinding. Oh yeah, some Skittles. Best trail snack. We're grinding away, man. We're almost 13 miles total. We're getting it done. <laughs> That is not a lake. That will be the last lake. That will be the last lake that we pass through on this enchantment hike. This is an incredible view. And then look at this raging waterfall down there. Look at that thing. Water is just rocketing out of that thing. It's crazy. We're just grinding it down, man. Trying to get back to the truck. All right. We officially hit 12 hours on the trail. So we've been out here for half a day which is crazy we're about 16 and three quarters mile total so far we reckon we have about three miles left and we'll be done final push this is where the grinding really starts man 
you just want to be off the trail you don't want to be walking anymore last little push here let's do it We can finally see the road. We can finally see the road, man. We're getting close. Look at that view too. Wow. We're almost out of here, man. We are almost out of here. Thank God. <laughs> We're gonna do it. Woo! We made it. Mm. <laughs> Woo! We are officially <coughs> enchantment goers. Or what would you call it? An enchantment achievers. Officially have checked off the through hike through the enchantments. Ball. Man, that was a doozy. Ended up being just over 20 miles. Total time of about 13 hours. Total ascent, 5,500 feet. Total calories, 4,300 calories, man. That was an absolute brute of a hike. It was everything it's hyped up to be. Highly recommend it. We are now heading back up to the coal truck trailhead to grab my car. And then we'll be heading back into Leavenworth, checking into our hotel. So we'll see you back in town, man. I need to go shower right now. This is home for the night. It ain't much, but it'll do. I need to shower immediately, like right now. Look how dirty the feet got. This is the dinner outfit. All cleaned up. Caleb's all cleaned up. Feels so good to take a shower after that long day. But now we're gonna head into Leavenworth, get some dinner, probably crack some brews, do a little celebration for this achievement. Such a big hike, been on our books for years. Finally knocked it off. So that is gonna end this video. We're gonna go get some dinner and get some Z's. So as always, thank you guys so much for watching. Thanks for being here. We'll see you guys in the next one. See you guys in the next one. Peace. Peace.